Hey guys, I'm going to tell you a story about an ex-bank robber here in Deep River. Here lies his grave, which you cannot tell, but it is very, very tiny. That's one that's next to it, a normal size one. But the story behind this is back in the turn of the century, there was a bank robber named Frank and four guys who were going to rob the Deep River Savings Bank. The bank had got word that they were going to rob it, so they hired this guy named Harry D. Wright to be security. And December 13th of 1899, these four men show up. They started to climb in the window, and Harry shot one of them in the face. The other three flew. So... About a week later, Harry had gotten a letter that looked like it was written in a lady's handwriting asking that this bank robber, that they know his name might be Frank, although he had quite a few different names, asking that his grave be placed with the letters of X, Y, and Z. So they obliged, they put the grave site here, and rumor has it that every December 13th, a woman in black, you cannot tell now, but down there are train tracks, she used to come to the Deep River train station, get off the train, walk up to this grave site, and put flowers on it. And this happened December 13th for about 40 years. They don't know who the woman was. They don't know where she ever went to. They don't know what the relative was to the Deep River bank robber. But that is the story behind the grave of XYZ. And people who come here throw money on this so that he does not haunt them. What throwing money at a ghost has anything to do with him not haunting you? I don't know. <laughs> but... That's the story behind the XYZ grave. Bye for now.